Alright, today we're going to talk about measuring the volumes of irregular objects. Last class we found out how to measure the volume of a rectangular object by measuring the height, width, and length. So for an example we're going to measure the volume of this phone. It's five inches long. We're going to multiply that by its width, which is three inches, and then by its height, which is one inch. So, five times three times one equals eight inches cubed, because we're talking about volume. So when you don't have a nice rectangular object to calculate the volume of, you can measure the volume by dropping the object in a container of water and measuring its displacement. Okay, so when you don't have a nice rectangular object to measure and you have something like this nail, you can use displacement and displacement is when you drop an object into fluid and you measure the change in fluid and you subtract the number after you drop the object by the number before you drop the object in to get the volume of the object. So with this nail, I'm going to drop it in. The water is currently at 400 milliliters. I drop it in and I can see here that it went up one milliliter. So it's really not a lot. So that way you take 401 milliliters minus 400 milliliters. You look good. Here. Okay. Go. Yep. Now we're going to demonstrate the volume of a rock. So I put the rock in the water. The rock goes, or the water goes up about 10 millimeters. So we subtracted 400 from 410 millimeters, and it would give us that the rock volume is 10 millimeters. Right? Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> So for our last two examples, I have a uh, 500 milliliter bottle, roughly, and a uh, X-Acto knife. So I'm going to take the X-Acto knife and place it in our 400 milliliters water. As you can see, it went up 30 milliliters. So that would make our milliliters 430 minus 400, which gives us 30 milliliters cubed for our knife. Next, I'm going to take the bottle. Again, roughly 400 or 500 milliliters. Place it in our 400 milliliters of water. And let's see, take it out. It's up to 900 milliliters. So we'll take uh, 900 milliliters and subtract 400 milliliters from it to get our 500 milliliters again. And uh, so that's our lesson on uh, this placement. So. Get, grab a buddy and uh, get nutty and let's do some displacement, people. Everybody was kung fu.